Welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode Season 2, Episode 1. I'm doing this again. Episode 1, we're going to continue off. Reason why is because I felt like playing it because there aren't any games for me to play other than Watch Dogs Legion. <clears throat> yeah, so I am looking forward to the Expanse today. <laughs> yes, um... The one by Telltale, the new Telltale games, not the old one. Yeah, so I did pre-order Telltale's The Expanse, a The Telltale series, a big mouthful, I guess, right there. I did pre-order that game on June 1st, so... And I am going to, well... So I am looking forward to playing that game next month on July. I did pre-order the Deluxe Edition because I want to play the bonus episode when it's out. So we got names of the episodes that are coming, alright. Episode 1 through 5. Oh, wow. The Upper Lowlands? Spider Peak Mountain? The Ice Crags of Doom? It's just like I told you, Jack might be the best adventurer in town. This stuff is from all over the world. See, Petra? Beacon Town has some pretty cool stuff too, huh? Oh, uh, well, I mean, what's cool about all of this is that it isn't from Beacon Town, though. But you've got a good point. This is a, a big win for Beacon Town. <clears throat> Welcome to Jack and Nerm's Adventure Emporium. <gasps> I mean, what's up? You push the button. Very, very brave. Thanks for noticing. I am very brave. Always good to see a hero that knows their own worth. <sighs> the warriors of the Whispering Mountain call me the Stab Walker. The Air Titans of the East call me he who slashes like thunder. But you may call me Jack. Lots of names too. The the people of Sky City call me the the Ground Finder. Other people know me as the Wither Slayer. You can call me uh, Jesse. Ah, cool names. So what can I do for you today? Desert Temple, Woodland Mansion. Whoa. Yeah, that's what we're here about. Uh, wow, huh? Crazy glove you got there. Not that I've ever seen one before. Uh, looks real crazy, though. Crazy stuff. Found this way underground beneath Beacon Town. Thought you might be able to help us figure out where it came from? You did, huh? You can, can't you? Found it on top of a creepy bottomless pit, right? Spitting out monsters. Yeah, and it had a slot with, like, a weird symbol. <sighs> you should have never picked up that gauntlet. It's not for us mortals to tamper with. I don't get it. What's the big deal? It's a glove. There's a hole in the ground. Oh, it's much more than that, friend. That pit. 
It's as deadly as they come. And that symbol you saw was the symbol of the structure block. Legend says it was a mighty tool that could grow civilizations like seeds, create cities in the blink of an eye. You need one of those to close your pit. So where can I get one of these structure blocks? Petra thought maybe an ocean monument because of the prismarine? Oh, it's an ocean monument, all right. The villagers of Mushroom Archipelago call it the Sea Temple. Mm-hmm. No, no, no problem. Guys, this is Nurm, my other half. He's the genius behind all of our fine maps. Nurm, this is Jesse and Petra. Hmm. Hi. Sup? What are you doing with your hands? I was just about to tell these two that I can't help them. What? I love your early work. Witherstorm, old builders, awesome. But as a purveyor of fine maps and adventures, your death would be terrible for business. But... Sorry. I just can't. Hmm. Okay, so why don't you come with us then? You could, I don't know, protect us? Be our guide? No. Vowed I'd never go back there again. Let me show you something. It's like I said before. The world's a lot bigger than you think it is, Jesse. square is where we need to go. Yep. And it's missing because... I, uh... kind of burned it. I threw it into a volcano, okay? What? Why? You didn't need that kind of danger anyway, all right? I swore I wouldn't take anyone else to that temple ever again. I refuse to let it take any more lives. Hmm. <laughs> Shut up, Nurm. What? Oh, I see what's going on here. You're scared. No. I'm the one the Apex Hunters of the Sergeo Pass call Fearless Dagger. I don't do scared. I found a gauntlet just like that once. Teamed up with my friends Voss and Sammy to follow its trail. Neither of them made it out alive. Hence, uh, you know... Lava, map, volcano, you remember what I was saying, anyway. But burning the map couldn't erase the horrible memories. And thanks to the curse of my perfect sense of direction, I couldn't forget the location of that temple if I tried. So, if you're the only one who knows where it is... Yep, without me, you never get to that sea temple. That knowledge is my curse. Hmm. Heavy. Hmm. Oh, you have no idea. Wow, that does sound rough, doesn't it, Petra? Yeah, it does. Too bad you won't let us help, though. Yeah, I guess we should just leave. Now, hang on a second. Sounds to me like a challenge. And no one, and I mean no one, challenges the Velvet Tornado. Me. And gets away with it. Yeah? Nerm, time to get our adventuring things. Mm. Jesse, it's perfect. Structure block? Sea temple? I know, it's amazing. It's almost too good to be true. Ah! Uh, yes! Oh, by the way, am I doing a good job playing it cool? Uh, think he thinks I'm cool? I know I was a little awkward at first. Petra, I'm gonna say this as your best friend and someone who cares about you very deeply. 
please never play it cool again. Never? Never, ever. Ouch. Okay, fine. Derm, I told you, it's not the admins. Ah, mm -hmm. oh, fine. What did he say? Nothing. Villager stuff. Nurm here wants to make a new map of this place. Uh, what with the uh, whole lava volcano incident. <laughs> Easy, Nurmy. Don't blow a gasket. Huh. I didn't know you villagers went on adventures. <laughs> yeah, most don't. <laughs> you know, I remember when we first met. <laughs> we had that uh, map. That's another story for another day. All you gotta know is there's no one else I'd rather have by my side. So that means we're off to the Sea Temple? Don't you think you're looking a little... squishy for that? Seriously? I mean, you're wearing a vest. The vest of five fists? Gifted to me by the singing clerics of Port... Okay, jeez, I get it. It's a cool vest. Come on, I just need to make a quick pit stop and I can show you some real armor. Oh, Jesse, I'm so glad you're here. Hey, Radar. There is a lot going on. Someone still needs to finalize the ideas for the Founding Day banners. The cake baking team can't agree on what color to make the front of their shop. The Woolmakers Guild isn't super happy about their booth being next to the Firework Union. Understandable. Radar. Gotta get from Boomtown. Ah! Sorry, got in the zone there. Uh, what's up, boss? I see you brought friends and a new accessory. Short version, the town's in danger. I stopped it for now, but I think this can help me fix it permanently. I'll be gone for a little bit. Gone? But, Jesse, what about Beacon Town? Founding Day is right around the corner, and if it's really in, in, in danger, who will protect everyone? There's no telling what could happen! And I have so few details. Why don't you try leading them, pal? What? Me? That's... this is... Try not to explode. Ah! Jesse, I won't let you down. I know you won't. Good luck, boss. Beacon Town will be waiting for you when you get back. Sure. Ha! Um, bye. Hey. <laughs> you said it. Can't believe that's your assistant. He's more wound up than a pack of parrots with a jukebox. Or a creeper in a herd of cats. Or a squid in a, I don't know, a box or something. Anyway, he's real nervous is what I'm saying. He's a little nuts, but his heart's in the right place. <clears throat> you say so. So, where's this armor of yours? Oh, wow. You got some pretty cool stuff here. Stuff I've never, uh, probably only seen you know, once or twice. Not as cool as my stuff, obviously, but uh, you're well on your way. Definitely on your way to becoming a big hero like me. Not as big, of course, but, uh, you know, a real, a real great swing. A strong, silent walk. Another good step. Oh, darn. Nice. Hey, wait, is this not where you keep your armor anymore? Yeah, I'm not seeing any armor. No? No, I just had Olivia install a little upgrade while she was here. Of infinity. I love how regal this one. I feel like Ivor might have been running out of ideas when he named it though. I'll choose the shield of infinity. The enchanted diamond sword. Good thing I have Very it. Nice. You look like one of the tree slashers of Gulun Bay. And that's very high praise. Now that's more like it. Agreed. 
Hey, uh, can you just give me and Jesse a minute? Huh? Aww. Listen, with the heck mouth and everything, I feel like I didn't get to properly apologize for all the stuff with my sword, Champion City. So, I'm sorry. You won't hear it again, so don't get used to it. I'll totally deny everything later. I appreciate it. I mean, it's pretty big of you. Hey, look, I really meant it. Ah, it really is big of me, isn't it? Okay, now with that sappy stuff out of the way, let's go find us a sea temple. Jack, Nurm, you guys ready to go? Always. So where are we going exactly? It's time to chart a course for Doom Sea. Oh. Shut up, Nurm. It's an awesome name. blade in hand and drove it right into the head of the Ikara zombie. I slept on an enormous pile of diamonds that night. Enormous? Oh, I can only imagine. <sighs> oh yeah, pretty typical day for me. You'll see. After this, I'll take you to this amazing woodland mansion I found. Yeah. Let's make that happen. It's really far from here. I love it. It's almost certain death. Hey, that sounds really cool. I can't wait either. Uh, yeah, sure, of course. All right, before we go down there, I feel I should give you one last warning. The rules as you know them, how the world works, those don't always apply in this temple. Hmm. Hey, what? Some people believe it's because this temple was made by the admin. The what? <sighs> Supposedly he's some all-powerful ancient person. Built the world, I don't know. But the legend of the admin is just that. A legend. A story. Bunch of superstitious malarkey, frankly. I've been to the swamps of Funja and back, and that's still one of the more ridiculous things I've ever heard. Well, that sounds like a load of junk. Glad we agree. But just remember, what you're gonna see in this temple, it'll stay with you. Well, John, you. Uh, we used this island as our staging area last time we were here. How can you be so sure it's the same one? Uh, Perfect internal compass. The... The sea temple is directly below us. It's like I can feel it. Hey, uh, how exactly are we going to breathe? I knew a guy that taught me how to hold my breath for ten minutes. I mean, that's impressive, but... Picked up these enchanted helmets from the deep dwellers of Honbar Kavas. Time to suit up and roll out.
Now, we're sure that we have all our limbs. How about we find that structure block? 